Hey guys, how are you doing on this beautiful Wednesday evening? This show I'm very excited about. It's all for moms. And actually, if you're not a mom, it doesn't matter. We have some really good stuff. It's just things that help us moms get through our days a little better. There's stuff for your kids. There's stuff for pregnancy. There's stuff to wake you up in the morning. Um, there's stuff to make you not look so sleepy if you didn't get a good night's sleep the night before. We even have a pregnancy pillow, which I think are for everybody. I think everybody should use a pregnancy pillow at least some point in their life because it's so comfortable. So I'm Frida with WTI and you have caught one of our amazing shows. Uh, we have shows every single day of the week, including the weekend. Uh, so I love our different themes and I'm very excited about this. All the lineups on this today and like these are all things that I either used when my kids were younger or I'm currently using to help me function through each and every day. So I'm glad you guys joined me. Hi, Brooklyn. Thanks for getting on. And Syed Muhammad, thank you so much for following us. You'll get notified of our live shows now. We have them all different uh, days of the week, but different times too, which I love because it's a little more helpful. Um, not everybody can get on, sneak at getting on while they're at work during the day. So hopefully I'm catching some of you on your way home from work today. So we will go ahead and get started. Um, I figured, I always like to start with coffee, but I figured first, before the coffee, I would show this. This is pretty neat. It's a necklace holder. I have various types. Um, I like that Brooke shows this in her bathroom as well because I notice if I have it in my bathroom, I'm more likely to actually not lose track of all my things. I can't sleep on my wedding ring. I always feel so swollen in the morning in my earrings. So having something nice in the bathroom for when I wash my face at night to put all my jewelry on. And this is such a beautiful necklace holder. It's very simple, but real like classy looking. Um, and it has room for more than just necklaces. So check this out from Brooke. Brooke with WTI. Do you want to display some of your finer jewelry on a gorgeous display? Well, check out Amazing Abby's Temptation Necklace Holder Stand. This holds my rings, my necklaces, my earrings, and I love how this base kind of has a lip that comes up a bit so I can stick a few of my stud earrings down at the bottom. I absolutely love this polished finish look. It looks like crystals next to my jewelry. Displaying it is beautiful and fun. It's not something I want to hide. I love the fact that it does spin. It makes me feel like I'm shopping at a jewelry store, yet without the damage. And I like the fact that it isn't very bulky. It is a little more than 12.12 .12 inches high, and the base is a little more than 4.12 inches wide. And yet it holds with the 12 hooks, quite a bit of jewelry. So it helps motivate me to get ready quicker so I don't have to go through my box of jewelry. And it also helps me to alternate my different jewelry pieces so that I can have them on display and use them and then change them up. So it really is beautiful, thoughtfully made. This is a nice quality jewelry display. It was very easy to put together. So absolutely love this product. It is very pretty, and I just like the way it looks and how easy it makes my life. But that's just my point of view. So pretty. You can tell she had a couple of them too. Very, very beautiful. So that is $18.99. And um, like I said, I like that it is, it's really pretty and shiny. Like she said, it's kind of that, like it has a little sparkly look to it. But to me, I like because it's very neutral. So you can put it with no matter what decor you have. It's more of a timeless item to display your to display your various things. So, um, and now we're going to get into what helps you wake up in the morning. I just thought that was a nice thing to put first so that you're not losing track of your things. Because that's one thing I'm really good at is losing track of where I put all of my my, I have actually lost my wedding ring before. I found it. It only took me a couple months, <laughs> but I'm real good at that. So having one of those in your bedroom, one in your bathroom, maybe I'll be less likely to lose things. But this is something I use a lot. These gold I, under eye patches, if you guys haven't used them yet, um, I just got my little sister hooked. She came up and stayed for a week and I sent her home with her own big industrial size pack of them because they're awesome. So good for making you look a little more awake in the morning. And my trick that I like to do is I put them on at night and then I keep the little container by my bedside and put them back in there and they re rehydrate themselves through the night. And then I put them back in the morning and I look real crazy when I take my kids to school, but that's okay. They're kind of used to it. So here's Brittany. This is Brittany with WTI, and if you suffer with dark circles, puffy eyes, or fine lines around your eyes, 
these gold eye patches are about to come in clutch. I love using these little eye patches because they're so easy to use. They go, they make you feel so good. They're so refreshing. And I also love that they actually work. <laughs> I notice a huge difference if I don't keep them in my routine because with them, it totally helps my eyes, especially I've noticed if I use them regularly, it makes an even bigger difference. So I use them a few mornings every week and they do so good. First of all, even when you put them on, they're so refreshing to your eyes. I don't actually even keep my little packages in the fridge, but they recommend that as an option. And I have several friends that use these as well and they keep theirs in the fridge and they're like, game changer. For me though, they're already pretty cool when I put them on. So I don't feel the need to, like I do have a cold house though, but they are so refreshing, feel so good. I keep mine on for 20 minutes to sometimes 45 minutes. I'll put them on and work out and forget I even have them on, but they just feel so good. I personally notice a huge difference, especially with, um, the moisture levels around my eyes because last thing I'm trying to do is get wrinkles around my eyes and I feel like they make a big difference in keeping my eyes looking youthful. So that's my point of view. They, they are legit. I have had friends who are like, but yeah, but do they really work? I'm like, yes, I'm obsessed. Brittany says she uses them a couple nights a week. I use them every single night and morning. If I can remember, <laughs> I'm also super paranoid because I am 40 and I'm getting the little lines by my eyes. And I'm like, no, I leave them on until there is nothing left to them. Like literally when you leave them on that long, you take them off and they're just, there's no moisture left on them. So I get every last drop of goodness out of them. <laughs> yes, Desiree, I believe, I, I agree with that. As a mom who is still tired from late nights, these are a must. I am past that stage with my kids. Now I'm staying up too late, not because kids are keeping me awake, but it's because it's the only time nobody's asking me to do anything for them. So my husband's like, why do you stay up so late? I'm like, because I just sit there and completely zone out and nobody asks me questions. And then next thing I know, it's like one in the morning. So completely my fault at this point, but they do feel really good. Uh, I do know people do recommend keeping them in the fridge. For me personally, I feel like they're, they stay cool enough in my house to where they're super refreshing when you put them on. My 11 year old likes to put hers in the freezer Whew, give you a big shock when you put them on, but they feel really good. So thank you, Alicia, Desiree, and Brooklyn for getting it. Or sorry, Alicia, Desiree. Yes, Brooklyn, I already said hi to you, but hi again. <laughs> All right, we'll move on a little bit. Oh, sorry. Those, this isn't technically a deal show, but those do have a really good sale today. So they're normally $14.99, but there's a 20% off coupon. So if you guys haven't tried them yet, now's the time to try them. I do like that they come individually packed, like I said, so you can put them back in there and rehydrate them through the night or just to be able to throw in your purse and have it any time. Um, I just went and visited a friend this weekend and I grabbed a bunch and threw them in my bag and we all had a little pampering night. <clears throat> Alrighty, so this is me. This is my video. I am obsessed. I went to see it with my sister almost a year ago and she had an espresso machine and I realized that that's actually, I, I did need it because it's so simple to make yourself a really high quality cup of coffee without having to go through and actually know what you're doing. You just put the pot in the machine and let it do its business. So I'll show the Nespresso machine. And then my sister's up next, the one who got me hooked uh, with the different pods. This is, it's her favorite type of pod. So we'll look at these videos back to back. Hey guys, I'm Free with WTI and I'm going to tell you what my secret to making it through every morning is. It's in this little machine right here. This is how I get my caffeine cake in the morning, but it tastes so much better than just a regular pot of coffee. If you guys haven't used an espresso machine yet, you are missing out. I went to stay with my sister. She had the same machine. It's an espresso virtuo. What's different about this machine is instead of just having an espresso or whatever this is di designed to do, these little pods are very unique. There's a barcode on the bottom of the pod and that tells the machine what type of coffee it needs to brew for the specific pod. So I can make myself a little shot of espresso, I can make an Americano, I can make just a regular cup of coffee. This one I'm going to make today is a creamy vanilla coffee. What I love most is that creamy part. You get that crema that you get with a really good quality espresso. 
in this machine without having to run an entire espresso machine. When you're done making the coffee and you open the top, it automatically throws the pod back into the little recycling canister. And I really like the way that this is designed because it catches the coffee, anything that has dripped, it'll catch it underneath. So it's easy to remove it from the side and clean it out. This is the real kicker, is their Arachino. It comes in the combo. You need this because it steams and froths your milk. And I notice it does so good, especially with oat milk. It gets it nice and creamy. So I'm making myself every morning a barista quality espresso drink for a fraction of the cost. And I don't have to leave my home to get it. I can get that caffeine flowing through my veins first thing in the morning. So if you're a coffee lover like me, but you want to save a little bit of time and money, the Nespresso Virtual Machine is top notch. I absolutely love this thing. And that's my point of view. No joke, guys. If you haven't had it, years ago, my friend had an espresso machine. I was like, what? That's cheating. And then I tried it and I'm like, oh, this is good. But staying with my sister for a couple days a row, in a row and every cup of coffee was just like, this is so good. I felt like we were running out and getting it from an actual, you know, brick and mortar store. So that's what convinced me. And before I'd even left her house, I had ordered it and had it sent to my house. and It was waiting for me when I came back. And that Arachino too, I love. I use the Arachino all the time, whether I'm making an a Nespresso cup of coffee or not, uh, the way it frosts the milk. I have, um, it's just a sweet cream creamer right now, but when you froth it in that Arachino, it tastes like marshmallow fluff. It's so good. This is not coffee. I had to calm down a little bit because a couple nights ago I drank coffee too late in the day and then I did not sleep. This is tension tamer tea because <laughs> my kids are home. <laughs> mm, very delicious. Calms me right down. You said you have one too, Brooklyn? Yeah. I know. Once my sister ruined me and I feel like I'm a little bit of a coffee snob. I'm always on the search for the ultimate cup of coffee. And once I had that all week at her house, I'm like, well, now I got to have it. So it is actually on deal today. It's actually less expensive right now than what I paid for it. So you get the machine and the Arachino, which you need to get the combo. Just get it for $179.94. So there's a couple of different options you can get. When I got mine, I actually got the machine, the Arachino, and then it came with a bunch of uh, like a sampler pack of the capsules because it's hard to know which ones you would like until you try them. But my sister's favorite is this video here, the Chiaro Pods. This is a very rich cup of coffee. Hi there, I'm Heather with WTI. Are your Monday mornings kind of a drag? Mine were too, but thanks to Nespresso and the Chiaro flavor, oh, Nespresso Pod, those Monday blues are a thing of the past. Take a look for yourself. Come along and have a taste, if you will. Albeit through the lens, but you can try and then you can throw it in your cart and probably have it today. So. <laughs> I feel like I should have a slow-mo here, but it's so beautiful, I can't even slow it down. These come 30 in a pack. And they are the 2.7 ounce. That brew, for me personally, I need two a day, and that is just right. I really love that Nespresso is collaborating with the Rainforest Alliance. This program makes it possible to sustain the livelihoods of our farmers. I really appreciate that. I also want to support people behind our coffee, and I love anyone who's helping protect our landscapes. To me, this intense, Earthy tone is exactly what I need to start my day. It also has a smidge of caramel, and pff, who's not a fan of that? Check out the creamy texture. This is without adding any creamer at all. I like to add a nut pod frothed creamer to the top, and ah, it's perfection. It's just that easy to turn this into this and say goodbye to your blues. Enjoy. So if your mornings have been kind of a drag, turn it around. Have a warm cup of goodness. The Chiaro blend is perfection. That's just my point of view. That video did not convince you that you need one. Do you see how talk, she just talks you right into it? Like having those all week at her house, I'm like, this is the best thing I've ever had. It is just delicious. It's so easy to use too. And that, like she said, that cream out on the top. Oh, it's so good. Hi, Kayla. Thank you for getting on today. Um, what was I going to say about those?
I don't remember. She just makes a beautiful video, doesn't she? She's very talented. She will say it's because she has an iPhone and I have an Android, but I disagree. I think she's just more talented. Um, but yeah, if you're if you're gonna try, if you're a first timer with an espresso, get the Chiaro. Though they are absolutely delicious. All right, we'll move on into our day. So I thought we all spend a lot of time in the kitchen. I know I do. Having an, a nice anti-fatigue mat is nice. I like that this one is narrow, but it's long. So it will stretch, you know, further. Like say you are doing dishes or you have to move it over to the stove. You have plenty of room to move around on it. So this is Jasmine. Hey there, I'm Jasmine with WTI. And I'd like you to raise your hand if after you've cooked a large meal and then you have to do the dishes, your feet and your back ache right here every day. <laughs> well, not so much anymore. I have found a seriously amazing helper. This is a Gel Pro anti-fatigue mat and Gel Pro has made these two spots in my kitchen my new favorite places to be. I have the linen khaki 20 inch by 72 inch mat. The design is subtle and the color is a rich warm tone. Gel Pro has an incredible array of sizes and styles, so there truly is something for every home. I love how thick the mat is, and it has a non-slip bottom layer. Your Gel Pro mat can easily be wiped down with a damp cloth, but most importantly, the thick layer of gel gives you the support and most comfortable cushion underfoot. I would highly recommend a Gel Pro mat, not just for your kitchen, but for your garage workspace and if you have a standing desk area. No need to throw in the towel after you've cooked that large meal and you have to do the dishes. Your new favorite place can be your kitchen once again with a Gel Pro mat. It's truly the squishiest, yummiest mat you will ever have. Your back and your feet will thank you. And that is my point of view. I did not realize until this time watching it that that 72 inches wide, so it's six feet wide for that herb. I guess long width would be the other way, 20 inch by 72 inch. If you don't have room for something quite that big, there are multiple sizes. There's a 20 by 36, a 20 by 48, and then like she showed the 20 by 72. But there's also a lot of really beautiful colors. So she has the linen khaki, but there's all sorts of different solid colors, or you can get a design on that too. The buffalo plaid is my favorite. I think that looks really pretty. So there's all sorts of options on that one. If you guys are looking for a good anti-fatigue mat, that's a good one to get today. Alrighty, since we're on our feet in the kitchen, I thought I would show a couple um, kitchen tools. I like these next two items specifically because they're multi functional. They're multi-use. So I don't have a lot of room in this kitchen. I'm always a big fan of something that does more than just one thing. So this food processor can do more than just food processing. Uh, the air fryer that we'll show does more than just air frying. So I thought these would be really good to show side by side. If you're looking for something that's multifunctional, these have got you. Hey there, I'm Jasmine with WTI and I'd like you to raise your hand if after you've cooked a large meal and then you have to do the dishes, your feet and your back ache right here. I just love Jasmine so much. I wanted to show her again. Sorry, guys. I pressed the wrong one. <laughs> I just think she's so cute and I love that video and I really need an anti-fatigue mat. But that's not what I meant to show you. I meant to show you the food processor. Here's Megan. Hey, it's Megan with WTI. And if you're like me and you are always looking for ways to save time in the kitchen because you have so many cooking tasks to complete, well, this Davivi food processor might just be the multitasker you're looking for. This food processor comes with three separate tops. It has the food processor top, a blender top, and a smaller grinder top. It also comes with several different attachments. All of this combined means that this unit can function in many different capacities. I personally really like the little suction cup feet on the bottom of the main motor base. This feature really grips onto my countertop and keeps it secure while I'm using it. It is really convenient and easy to be able to swap out any of the tops depending on my needs. I can use the blender top for making smoothies, but it also works well for making my red pepper hummus. And when it comes to making a pie crust from cookies, well, I can put away the plastic bag and the rolling pin like I used to use. 
The food processor top was much faster and I had my pie crust done in no time. And when I need a lot of freshly ground pepper for a recipe, well, I can put a hold on the carpal tunnel syndrome and I can just use the small grinder. It ground the pepper really well into the perfect consistency. This Davivi food processor is great for getting many different kitchen tasks completed without having to buy a whole bunch of different kitchen appliances. And that's my point of view. So was anybody else just starving <laughs> when you saw her making that Oreo cake? Oh, that's absolutely delicious. I love those. But she's right. The only other option is to take and put it in the bag and just beat it to death with uh, a rolling pin or I've even done like a meat cleaver before too but that is a lot easier just I just love that it does so many different things too my ninja is close to that but they, that food processor um, does a lot better than than me just putting it in the blender it, it is just a different consistency that it makes whenever you put it in the food processor and this is the air fryer I love this check out the extra feature that it does it's more than just air frying Hi there, I'm Christy with WTI. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I'm not a huge fan of cooking, but I do love this air fryer from Chefman because it makes the process of cooking easier and faster. The air fryer I had prior to this one was just a single basket design. I love the way this one's designed. I much prefer it. It's got three individual mesh trays, which makes cooking multiple things at once easier. If I want, I can cook an entire meal in just the air fryer. Another feature this air fryer had, my other one didn't, is this clear window. I like that because I can easily glance in there and kind of monitor how things are cooking to see if I need to adjust time or temperature. But this isn't just an air fryer, you guys. This is also a dehydrator. So I dehydrated some bananas in here. They came out awesome. My kids said they tasted like fruit snacks. So that is a huge win. It also comes with a couple accessories that really set it apart. So you have a rotating basket. That's perfect for cooking fries. It helps them to crisp nice and even. And then you also have this additional accessory and you can cook an entire chicken in this thing. It's like a rotisserie. So it will turn the chicken as it cooks. And I'm not kidding you. It cooked the best chicken ever. It cooks it nice, brown, crispy. It was moist. It was perfect. I'll never use my oven again to cook a chicken. This is also great for cooking frozen items like my kids' chicken nuggets, French toast sticks, because I don't have to preheat it and it cooks in half the time. This is definitely not one of those appliances that just sit in my cabinet. I use it all the time. And that's my point of view. Uh -huh. I don't have dinner planned yet. So all these videos, I probably shouldn't have played those right in a row because now I'm absolutely starving. You're right, Kayla, that it is spacious. So that's the 10 quart one that Christy showed us. It goes all the way up to 12 quart. So depending on how much dehydrating or air frying you need to do, uh, five quart, 6.3, 10, and a 12 are uh, what that one comes in. But I loved just all those extra features. The dehydrating I think is awesome. Um, I'm always buying dehydrated fruits for my kids instead of fruit snacks. Uh, but man, it would be a lot more, a lot less <laughs> rough on my wallet if I could just dehydrate them at home. We just bought some dehydrated kiwi slices and they were delicious, but they were pretty expensive. Um, being able to do that, that basket for the fries, so cool. Being able to put a chicken in there. I mean, like she said, I don't think I would use my oven at all either. I was just at my friend's today and I used her air fryer for just some little chicken nugget bites. And like in six minutes, they're perfectly hot. My oven wouldn't even be preheated in that time. So those, they really do come in handy, but being able to get multifunction. So just one device to do a lot of different things, just a lot easier, easier on your wallet, easier on your kitchen storage. Hi, Freddie. Thank you for getting on. Is it making you hungry? <laughs> Um, this is another thing I love. I really miss that my babies are now too old for this. They're, I was just looking at these kids' tables the other day, and then it dawned on me that my littlest is going to be eight next week, and they're too big for these tables. But a kid's table was something that we used constantly when they were little for art time, for Play-Doh, for kinetic sand, drawing, um, snacks. When we had friends over for dinner and there wasn't room at the table, getting a little kid's table comes in very handy. And I love that Desiree showed us how easy this one was to put together. 
Hi, my name is Desiree with WTI and I have found the perfect little table for your little ones. Now, this is a great activity table, an area for them to eat. I mean, the possibilities are endless, but not only is it cute and the colors of pink and purple, which for me were great because I have two girls, it not only fits my two-year-old, but also my nine-year-old. They have fun playing together. But the best part is as a mom, it's easy to assemble. It literally took me less than 15 minutes to put this table together. The instructions were easy, all the parts were there, and believe me, there are not many. And voila, it came together and it is perfect for our little play area here in the living room and she is having so much fun sitting on this table so if you've been in search for something easy to put together and something that is cute for a playroom or a play area then check this table out from tiny geeks but not only is it the table you also get the two chairs which is great so Look no further than this set, but that's just my point of view. It's so cute. Oh, it just makes me sad, but we did, we did use it a lot. The one I had folded completely up so we could put it away. But honestly, we just left it out all the time because kids just, this just having something pint sized like that for them just makes them feel really special too. So, all right. This is another thing that we have, we've made good use of. Um, I, I love that trampolines are a lot safer than they were when I was a kid. I remember falling off them multiple times or getting my legs stuck in between the springs and hurting myself. Now they have the nice mat around the the sides. They have the uh, nets, which we have too. So all things that you need to have just because that to me, a trampoline is a giant playpen. <laughs> You just throw my kids in there and it's nice to not have to worry about them out there jumping around with all their friends. So this is a really nice one from Paola. Um, she's right that you can put these together yourself. I did put ours together myself this year, uh, but it is nice to have a friend to help you just because the kids are right there begging you to get it done quickly. So she shows us also how quick this thing was to put up and how much fun she and her kids have on it. Hey guys, Paula here from WTI. And have you ever had a trampoline? I had it, and I am so happy to finally have fulfilled this childhood dream of mine. But as a parent, I was a little oh. hesitant to get one because of the safety concerns. Now, Jumpzilla, they get me. They design key features that make me feel a lot better about letting my kids on here. For starters, it has this safety net and these curved bars. So if you do happen to hit the walls, you're not gonna hit the metal as well. Now, everything you need comes in one box to assemble it. You could do this completely on your own, but I recommend doing it with two people because kids wanna jump as soon as possible. Now, the frame itself has four legs instead of three, so that right there makes it a lot more stable than other brands, and it is powder coated, so it's resistant to rust. Where we live, we have already gone through a couple of storms through this season, and so far, this looks perfectly intact. And this 14-foot trampoline is perfect if you have kids in gymnastics. They can practice their tumbling. It has the ability to hold up to 450 pounds. We have pushed it further than that, but I do recommend for safety, you don't have a lot of people on at once. I'm really happy with this trampoline, and so are my kids. But that's my point of view. Thank you, Paola. Yeah, ours has held up really well, too. I will say, I think that her view is a little bit prettier than mine with all of those palm trees in the background. We've got trees, but I prefer the look of some palm trees. So, And we have left ours up. Um, if we are good parents that year, we usually try to remember to take the net and everything down before it snows. But we got our first snow of the year already yesterday, and the trampoline's still up in the backyard. So we have to get to that. But um, I just, I agree. I just feel so much better about it, knowing that there are locked in there having the zipper enclosure on it and everything um this is a really good one if you guys have been looking i don't know if you noticed when she put the net on but having those ties are really nice we've gone through a couple different nets um and it does matter how they attach to the springs um some of them have had an attachment that has torn really easily so that's a really nice quality one and it comes with everything you need the fact that the bars have the um, cushioning on them it has the ladder it has the padding it has the net everything you could possibly need 
one of the things my kids have been wanting me to get is they now make like tent enclosures for trampolines. So we want to get one so that we can camp out there at night. So this is an actual playpen. I always tease that that's my kid's playpen. This is an actual playpen for babies and you can fit an adult in it too. I thought this was really awesome how Brooke showed uh, that she and her baby's grandpa both fit in this thing to play. Hey there, it's Brooke with WTI. Welcome to our favorite new play yard for our one-year-old. This is the Pop and Go playpen from the California Beach Company and it's awesome. Our one-year-old is constantly on the go and he gets into everything. So this playpen is exactly what we need. It's so fast and easy to set up. It really does pop up and it has these reinforcing rods to go along the edges. So if the kids can reach this height when they're hanging on it, it's nice and strong and they can't pull it down. This is the difference between with the rod and without the rod. It's a lot better. My son's pretty tall for his age, and as you can see, he can't even reach the top. So they've got a long time to play in this before they're too big. And as you can see, you can never really be too big because he's playing with his grandpa in it right here, and they both fit just fine. It's great for bringing to my parents' place because he can't get into anything, and he just plays in there with all his toys because there's so much space. It's super easy to take down too. You just take it apart like an umbrella and it flops right down. And then you fold it all up and it goes really small into this compact bag. And it even comes with pegs for sand and the ground for when you can use it outside. We're still snow covered here where we are, but I can't wait for the summertime to use this awesome sun canopy shade because it protects the babies from the sun so you don't have to worry about them getting burnt. There's so much space for playing in this play yard and extra room for adults even. And it's so easy to put together and take apart. It's going to be your favorite play yard ever. And that's my point of view. I did like how that broke down. I don't know if you guys noticed that she just pulled that little clip out, the safety clip, and then the whole thing folded up. Cause that's always something that I struggle with, with new strollers, play pins, all of that, not knowing which, <laughs> which button or lever to pull to actually get it to take down. And I'm sorry, I forgot to highlight that for you guys. So pop and go premium. Let's see. Oh, I just pulled up the trampoline again because I wanted to tell you, actually, there's different colors to the trampoline, but I meant to show you the pop and go. Do you guys see it pop up there? So along the bottom of the carousel is everything that I'm going to show you guys, but I'm trying to highlight them so they pop up and you can see what happens to be next on the carousel. But it comes in acre gray, orange, soft pink, sweet mint, and warm ivory. I thought this was really cool, too, because... Those to me are more of unique colors to have a playpen. I love that sweet mint is absolutely gorgeous. So depending on what you like to go for, you can make it look really pretty in your house because I think that's something I would probably leave up all the time. And like she mentioned, taking it to the grandparents' house too, wonderful because there's a lot of breakables usually at grandparents' house. So being able to put the little one in there and not worry about them hurting themselves or breaking anything is really nice. Um, I have a friend who just had a baby, and I know when my kids were little, I didn't realize as much how good black and white, like the contrasting colors are for little, little babies. And she just sent me a video of her daughter loving tummy time because of having a book like this right in front of her with the black and white. So if you um, are expecting or know someone who's expecting, this is a really good gift to get them that a new mom might not necessarily think of. Hey there, I'm Sarah with WTI, and if you have a sweet newborn in your life, you may be looking for an educational toy that will also keep baby's attention. We'll look no further than this sweet book from Zakoto. So this is the perfect gift for baby because it comes with high contrast crinkly pages, a silicone teether that's attached, a mirror so it makes tummy time and activity super fun for baby and super stimulating. I love how the pages are colorful and bright and then there's the black and white contrast pages on the other side so you can flip it over. There's so much detail to this and it stands up on its own so tummy time it's perfect for baby. Not only are they getting that time on their um, belly but they're also being stimulated by their um, mind by looking at the images, by able to being able to see their own reflection in the mirror, chewing on the teething um, toy, and just touching those crinkly pages. I really think that this is a wonderful way to engage with baby, especially at a very young age and as they grow. 
and it thoughtfully uh, comes in a little box so that you can give it as a gift uh, for the baby in your life. And I'm sure any parent who received this would be so happy. It's great for travel, so it will work well in the car or on a plane. I just think it's so sweet. I love the drawings, the illustrations are adorable. So if you're looking for the perfect educational stimulation gift for a baby in your life, I highly recommend this sweet book from the crinkly pages to the adorable illustrations and even the thoughtful little silicone teether. So don't hesitate. This is just a perfect gift. And that is my point of view. So having that being multiple sided too, as the kid gets older and they can start to see the colors like that. Um, it's nice to have both of those sides. Plus, did you notice there's a little teether on it too? So everything about that book is perfect for a new parent. Actually, I'm going to a baby shower next weekend for one of my sweet girls. I was just in her wedding, feels like only a couple months ago, and she's already having a baby. I'm so excited for her. So that is definitely going on my list. Thank you, Donald Halstead, for giving us a follow. I appreciate, uh, appreciate the support in the chat. And Rick, Rick and Janine, I'm sorry, um, I can't help you with customer service, but if you guys go to the listing, what always helps me is you can go to the listing and there's a little button on the right that says ask a question, and that's the best way to contact for any troubles that you have. But I'm sorry, I can't help you with those. Uh, this is a show all about things that make mom's life easier. So this nursery chair, man, this is another thing that has come a long way since I had kid, little ones. I don't think that rocking chairs or gliders were as pretty when my kids were little. This one is gorgeous. I could see me getting this and keeping it whether or not I had little ones in the house. This is so beautiful. Hey, I'm Jasmine with WTI and I'm sitting on my brand new rocking chair from Oka Copa, which I am obsessed with. It is so comfortable, so beautiful. I love how it looks in our nursery. I love the wood accents on the chair. I feel like they match so well with our nursery and the fabric is a really nice quality, soft linen fabric. And I love that they give you this pillow for lumbar support. That's so thoughtful, it makes it so much more comfortable. And you feel like the rocking chair is very sturdy when you're rocking. It's not flimsy at all. And the fact that you get an ottoman too, what more can you ask for? It's the perfect chair for a nursery. My husband loves it too. He loves to come here, sit and relax. Once we have the baby, we are going to be fighting over who sits in the chair with him. So if you're in the market for a comfortable, beautiful rocking chair for your nursery, definitely check out this one from Oka Copa. They go the extra mile by including the ottoman and you won't be disappointed with the quality and comfort of this rocking chair. But that's just my point of view. Yes, and it definitely needs the ottoman too. Just being able to put your feet up. That was how um, my oldest baby and my youngest baby loved to be rocked to sleep every night. The middle one just wanted me to put her down in the crib and walk away. <laughs> but I loved being able to rock them to sleep at night and then the multiple times they got up during the night too. Sorry for all your mamas still going through that stage. I was just telling my friend who's ha having her baby soon that that is the hardest part, I think, is in the very beginning, your body adjusting to how little sleep you actually get. And you think you can't do it, but I promise you, you guys you can just hold on and pretty soon your body adjusts to less sleep and then next thing you know you're functioning like a normal human even though you did not get the sleep that a normal human could need this is another thing that really helps a lot smart by baby monitors these have come a long way as well um especially well i was this way with all three kids but um just worrying about them while they sleep constantly checking on them and then half the time you're waking them up when you're checking on them having a really good monitor is helpful i like how portable this is because you just look at it on your phone so you can take it with you but check out the extra unique feature um, as a part of this monitor to really keep an eye on your baby Hi there, I'm Brianna with WTI, and I want to show you this amazing set by SenseU that I got. This would make an amazing gift for a mom to be in your life, or if you're expecting, you gotta pick this up for peace of mind. So it comes with a video monitor and a baby movement monitor. The baby monitor itself is really well made, very sleek and very lightweight. It has two-way talking, it has motion detection alerts, 
and it has really great night vision mode. Um, it also has everything integrated into the Sense You app, which is very user friendly. Um, you can have your camera, your baby monitor, and other products that Sense You sells all right there in the app. Now, the quality is also super high definition. As you can see here, it has 1080 HD, super clear. And just if you want to keep a really good eye on your baby and also see details, see really well in the dark, I highly suggest this baby monitor. It's the best one I have tried. Now you also have a baby movement station that will change color depending on how your baby is, if they have a high temperature, if they're sleeping on their belly. The monitor itself is so easy to clip on the diaper. And here in the app, I have it sped up so you can see it accurately records baby's position as well as breathing rate, temperature, even room temperature and humidity. So this is an amazing set. And that's my point of view. I thought that was really neat. Um, when, right when my kids were little, they had just come out with a pad that you put underneath the mattress that would sense if the baby stopped breathing. Um, Cause I know that's a really scary thing to think of, but sometimes it would go off even when the baby was breathing and we would just run upstairs completely panicked. So they have really come a long way. Um, if you're a new mom too, I know a lot of monitors come with its own little monitor display. I am really loving, I'm really loving that it can go to your phone uh, because it doesn't keep you within a certain, you had with the monitors, you have to be a certain distance, you know, but if you're on your phone and it's an app and you happen to be, so you had to go to work and you left the baby with a nanny or a grandma, um, being able to keep an eye on them from there, it just really sets your mind at ease. Uh, so I just, I really like that. We have a friend who uh, has a little one and her monitor will lose signal if she goes into her garage. So being able to have that on your phone is nice because you don't have to worry about the signal being interrupted. I just think it's really nice for peace of mind because I was always going in there. It wasn't enough just to look. I'm like, is she really breathing? And the next thing you know, I'm putting my hand on her back and then I'm waking her up. So having that is very helpful along with the baby gate too. Sorry, Diana. Thank you so much for joining us today and following us. You'll get notified of all of our shows now. <clears throat> I'm sorry, Rick, that I can't help you with that. I, I would be nice if it was free, wouldn't it? But if you can, if you go to your listing, you should be able to find, um, ask a question on there or just us. Uh, if you search in the search bar, Amazon customer service help, that should really be helpful too. Uh, but having this, I think this is cute because she, uh, Katie's like, I don't have kids, but this baby cut gate comes in handy for more than just kids. If you have any naughty pets that you have to keep separate, this is a really nice option. Hello, I'm Katie with WTI and this baby gate from Kembor has made my life so much easier and here is why. I actually don't use this gate for babies, I use it for my pets. Downstairs is my dog's domain and upstairs is my cat's. So to make sure that my dog doesn't sneak upstairs, we use this gate. Now my favorite thing about this gate is the auto close. With our prior gate, members of the family would forget to close the gate and it became an issue. With this gate, I finally have peace of mind. It was very easy to install. It came with extra parts to ensure that you can fit it to your needs. It can stretch from 29.7 inches to 46 inches. I also love how thinly it's designed. From the side, you can't even see it on my stairs, making it very discreet. It can be installed in two ways, with a pressure mount, or you can also screw it into the wall. We prefer to just use the pressure mount so that we don't have to have any holes in the walls. And this option also makes it very renter friendly. So I highly recommend this gate. And now you know, try it for yourself. And that is my point of view. She's so sweet. Oh, other family members weren't remembering to close the gate. So yeah, just get one that automatically closes. Then you, know, you don't have to be mad at anybody anymore. All right, we have a couple more things that are specifically for kids, but I thought this would be a nice little break. This laundry hamper is gorgeous. We can't get away from laundry, you guys. I had to clean. I don't know if you can see my couch behind me. Before the show, I had to hurry up and move the laundry to the other side of the couch. It's just a never-ending issue in our household, I feel like. I don't mind folding it. Wash, dry, fold, no problem at all. I hate putting it away. And it's just, it's it's my nemesis is laundry. So if you can have a really pretty laundry hamper like this, it's huge, it's multifunctional. You can use it as a table. It comes with really beautiful labels that you can iron on. I think Kate found 
the perfect laundry hamper. Hey, here with WTI and check out my gorgeous laundry solution from Alofa. So this will not only make your laundry days more organized, but it adds a beautiful element of decor and functionality. They come in different sizes. So this one comes with the three laundry bags. They glide out so nice and easy and you can organize this however you wish. So they do come with labels for both colors, whites and darks. So you can iron those on. It even comes with a little board to back it, to put it right on your bags, or you can leave them as is like I have. My favorite part is this gorgeous wooden top. So I love that I can use this for decor or even right now I have my laundry balls on it, but then you can also dress it up, dress it down, use it however you wish, but it's really beautiful, easy to clean of course, but just adds that little bit of rustic wood element, which I love. It comes with two sets of feet, so you can either use the wheels or you can have a stationary foot, depending on whether you move it around a lot or not. I have the wheels on mine and I love how easy it is to take from room to room, location to location. It makes it very convenient. It's a breeze to put together. It comes with the instructions and the Allen key you need. Really simple, it goes together in just a matter of minutes. So you can see that it comes with the laundry bags and they Velcro right on. So it's very easy to take off as well. So if you do have it stationary in a room and you wanna be able to take out the laundry bag to fill up or to bring to the washing machine or whatever, it's really easy to put on and take off. It's nice and sturdy, it's very well made and I just love the entire look of it. It is beautiful, but it's functional because you can put all of your dirty laundry in here, keep it off the floor, keep it out of those ugly hampers and in something really pretty that looks great in your space. I have no doubt that you'll be really impressed with it as I was, and that's my point of view. Sorry, I'm just so busy like looking at that listing. It's so pretty. So like she said, that's the three section. You can get the two section and the one section too. Three section, I mean, if you have a family like mine, you're gonna need all three sections. Um, there is black that she showed us with that nice wooden top, gray and white. So you have multiple versions. And like she said, you don't have to put the wheels on the bottom. You can just have a stationary too. I would probably use the wheels, um, but this would be perfect for someone too if you have that extra space in your laundry. A lot of people will have like a laundry folding area um, installed and this just slides right underneath it it's perfect and being able to separate them too I don't don't separate my colors from my whites but I just started last week because I realized how dirty all of my white towels were getting because I just I'm like yeah you don't need to separate anything and I found all new white towels and now I'm trying really hard to make them last a little bit longer so all right uh let's see Potty training, if any of you are going through that, it's not fun. I love this idea. I really didn't love having a separate little potty because it's just an extra thing to clean on top of everything else you have to clean. This is such a cool idea. Hannah found this and it just goes right over your existing toilet. Really great design. It folds up to store so you don't have to leave it there all the time. And again, I think Hannah found like it, just an awesome potty training tool. Hi, it's Hannah with WTI. If you are about to potty train, are potty training, or have succeeded and your toddler is potty trained, I have something that will greatly improve your life. This potty training toilet with stool by Two Right is really helpful. It can be a difficult process to get your little one to go potty, but this thing really helps. I feel like it makes them feel very comfortable on top of a regular toilet. My concern with one of these is that it would be hard for the rest of us when we had to go. But this thing is so easy. It folds and takes up no space next to our toilet. It just stores between the wall. And within seconds, I can put it on and it's all ready for her as well. She's two and she had no problem climbing up and down on this. And as you can see, it is very comfortable. It even has a little bit of squish on the toilet seat. So it's nice and comfortable, which is so important when they're learning to get rid of any fear. So if they're comfortable, it's gonna be much easier for them to learn. It's very adjustable, so you have different heights for the steps, and it also tilts out depending on how high your toilet is. So it will fit lots of different heights of toilets. I can't imagine using anything else because with this, you're not cleaning out a little potty chair every time they go. It goes into the regular toilet. So like I said, if you have a toddler and you're trying to train them on the toilet, this is a must have. It is easy to keep clean. It makes them feel comfortable on a regular toilet and they can get up and down all by themselves. What else can you ask for? But 
That's just my point of view. So it comes in green like she showed us, pink or yellow. I just love the design. It's very simple. It doesn't have a ton of different colors on it. So it can go well with your bathroom decor, but also it's appealing to a kid because it has like those bright, pretty colors. Um, and I love that she showed that it's adjustable because we're not all going to have the same height of toilet. So it's nice to have that adjustable on there too. Uh, with my son, I noticed what really helped him learn quicker was to teach him standing up instead of switching him from sitting to potty train to standing up. So I would stand him on the toilet so that he could go. But this is really nice because he could just stand on the step instead, uh, whether they need to sit or stand. Having both of those options is really nice. Another thing for kids, brushing their teeth is always a fight in this house every single night. So I'm always trying to make it as fun as possible. Having a cute toothbrush does the trick. This one looks like a rocket ship. Perfect way to get your kids to not fight you so much. Hi, it's Laura with WTI. And if you're ready to teach your little ones oral care and have them enjoy it, then you definitely need this electric toothbrush by Oral Master. What I love about it is the unique design. It actually looks like a little rocket ship waiting to be launched. My niece really enjoyed it when she got it. She thought it was a toy, but obviously she gets to use it every time she brushes her teeth. It makes it very fun and very easy. Not only that, it comes with a two minute timer. So that kind of helps you train your child to know how long they should be really brushing their teeth. Now the buttons on it are very simple. You have five intensity levels. So talk about cleaning, whitening, gum care, it's all included and it's just with the push of a button. So you can really, really help your little one to start on those right and good habits with oral care. My niece really has enjoyed this electric toothbrush herself. I think your kids will really enjoy it too. And that's just my point of view. The two minute timer is a game changer too, because we have both manual toothbrushes and electric toothbrushes. And um, sometimes they come out and I'm like, yeah, there's no way that was two minutes. There's absolutely no way. So the fact that it buzzes and lets you know when your two minutes is up um, also buzzes to let you know to switch, you know, which part of your teeth that you're doing. Uh, an electric toothbrush is really a must have for little kids because especially when they start to do it themselves, they're just not doing a good enough job. No matter how hard they try, they're not doing a good enough job. So at least that can take away some of the guesswork on how long they brush their teeth and how well they brush their teeth too. We're back to moms. The rest of the stuff on the show is going to be just for mamas. So, sorry, the spa gift set. So I had a friend send me a spa gift set a couple months ago. And it's so nice. They think of everything and it comes in a nice, cute little box. Because I'm always, uh, when I have a friend, you know, lose a loved one or going through a rough time, I'm always on Amazon looking to see what I can get them and trying to put together my own little box. These gift sets are perfect. I loved everything that Hannah said was in hers. So check this out. If you, you can get it for yourself too, guys. You don't just have to get it for a gift for someone else. Hey, it's Hannah with WTI. If you're looking for a spa set to gift to someone that you love or even just a gift to yourself, then this one from Picoli is so beautiful. This gift set is exactly what you need to pamper yourself. Everything about it is curated so beautifully. It comes with everything you need for a relaxing spa night. It has this wonderful body butter that goes on so smoothly and creamy. This rose bath salt, hand cream, a bath bomb, a beautiful candle that is filled with rose petals, a massage oil, and this handmade soap that comes in its own soap bag. All of this comes wrapped in the most gorgeous gift box I have ever seen also with a card and that sign for the door to inform everyone that pampering is in progress. So I really loved this gift box. I think it is the perfect thing to pamper yourself or someone that you love, and it is definitely worth purchasing. And that is my point of view. The soap bag is super cool. I never realized that that's what that was for. It's made out of like loofah material, but sewn into a bag and you put the um, 
bar of soap in there and then that's what you just clean yourself with and the loofah is really good because it keeps any sort of germs and stuff from building up on on it and you just keep it in the shower at all times i only discovered that a couple months ago i don't know why i never knew that that's what those bags were made out of so really really nice um thing gift for mom gift for you gift for a friend including this next item i love having my feet massage and i remember my mom asking me to do it all the time when we were little and i never wanted to and I feel like a jerk because I didn't realize how bad my feet hurt by the end of the day. And I'm like, I should have rubbed my mom's feet more. Uh, or you can just get yourself one of these. And you don't have to beg anybody to rub your feet. This is Alex. Hi there. I'm Alex from WTI. And I wanted to show you this great shiatsu foot massager from Neck Tech. Let me show you what I like about it and why I would recommend it. First of all, I really like how it's compact and it's quiet. I can... Watch TV, the quiet noise it makes is not a bother. Really appreciate that. And here's a little clip just to give you an idea of how quiet it is. It's a nice, gentle massage. It's not super strong, but it's just nice enough to kind of get your feet um, circulation going in your feet and have a nice little massage. Your feet will feel really good after. I also like that these parts zip off so you can wash them. I usually wear socks in mine just to keep them a bit cleaner, but that's a nice feature as well. I use mine on carpet, but if you want to use yours on a harder surface, there's actually little suction cups on the bottom so that they stick better and it doesn't slide around. It's a great feature. Overall, it's a great foot massager. I've been happy with it. My whole family uses it and our feet feel really nice after a long day of work. It's great to come home to put the, and use this handy tool. Um, your feet are gonna love it too, and that's my point of view. Yes, I agree, Brooklyn. That would make me feel a little grossed out thinking, how am I going to wash this thing? But knowing that that zips out and you can wash them, perfect. And then no more begging people to rub my feet. <laughs> my back hurts too. I need that for feet and for back. That would be very helpful by the end of the day. I think I just need an entire chair. All right, pregnancy pillows, guys. I told you at the beginning of the show, they are not just for pregnant people. This one's awesome because of how adjustable it is. So depending on how much stuffing you need in it, I don't think I've seen one before. Obviously, the pillows we have, you can take the fluffy stuffing out of them, the fluffy fluffiness out of them. But I've never seen a body pillow that you can do that with too. So pregnancy pillows are incredible. If mine was not so trashed by the time I got done with having three kids, I would have kept it for just every night because now I have like 15 pillows around me to keep me comfortable. This is all you need, just this one pillow. Hey there, I'm Sarah with WTI. And if you're looking for a little extra support when you're sleeping or just sitting, then you have to try this incredible pillow from Comfit. So this is an adjustable body pillow. It's designed to support you throughout your entire pregnancy and beyond. Because it has fluff that is removable, so the actual contents of the pillow can be taken out or added back in, you can literally create a personalized amount of firmness. And it's adjustable, so as your body changes throughout your pregnancy, you can add more fluff or take more out. I love the fact that the cover is easy to remove and washable and that you can use this body pillow in so many different positions to support you, whether you're sitting, whether you're lying down, even after baby is born, if you need extra support while nursing or just extra support for baby, you can use it for the baby, you can use the pillow for yourself. Because it stretches out to a full long length, you can literally curl up and cuddle with this into so many different positions. I find this pillow to be very supportive and comfortable, and I love the fact that I can wash the cover easily, and I can also open it up on the inside and take some of the fluff out if I want a little less um, firmness, or I can put it back in if I need more. This pillow is so comfortable and supportive. Whether you need it for your lower back or whether you need to support your knees while you're sleeping, if you're pregnant or if you just have a newborn to support, 
really this pillow is going to just adapt and grow with you whatever your needs are i love the way it's washable adaptable and so supportive and comfortable and that is my point of view that she showed that in every position that you could possibly need the one at the end when she shoved it under her belly a little bit i never realized until i was very very pregnant how much your belly hurts when you lay on the side because it kind of just is all the pressure is going down so being able to put a nice little pillow underneath that to hold your belly in place when you lay on your side is awesome pregnancy pillows are just the way to go so that's it guys that's it for our show i hope you enjoyed our mom's show mom must haves so tomorrow and friday saturday and sunday you guys can get some deal shows so on those shows every single thing that we have on the show are on deal so let's see i was gonna tell you guys what time our shows were tomorrow what's today today's wednesday right yep it's the first i should know <laughs> tomorrow morning at 11 at 3 p.m. and at 7 p.m. are our deal shows. And then on Friday, we have them at 11.30, 3 and 7. Saturday at 3.30 and Sunday at 5.30. So we always have shows seven days a week, but we concentrate on the deal shows at the end of the week because who doesn't love a good deal? Next week, as part of our theme shows, we have Winter Wardrobe on Monday, Active Winter on Tuesday, and I'm on Wednesday with Top 20 Picks. How dare they have so many winter themes? It did, it did snow here yesterday, though, so I guess it is coming for us strong. So... Thank you guys so much for um, joining me today, and I hope that you really enjoyed yourselves. Give us a follow. You'll get notified of all of our shows throughout the week so that you don't miss any of our good deals. Take care. <laughs>